Welcome to my channel once again, friends. Today we are looking at the iconic station of RAF Caister. 1940 constructed, uh, op operational from 1940 to 1945, then closed, then reopened uh, again for the, uh, for the Cold War and then closed back in 63. So what you can see is a few blocks left, um, that's pretty much it. And some missile pads and one blister hangar, which we'll take a little flight over shortly. Sadly, some of the buildings are in a little bit of a disrepair, um, but uh, I mean, the age, look at the age of them, so it's, it's understandable. some pictures um, it's one of the original pictures uh, that one's an original picture and that one is and that one and this is what uh, it would have looked like in one of the uh, blister hangers so as we take a flight over to the northeastern side of the airfield that's uh, pretty much maybe that was uh, home for repairs maintenance There is talk of Hawker Hurricanes being uh, on this site, uh, so maybe that's where uh, maintenance, things like that, uh, took place. I don't know how many of those uh, blister hangers there was. Strange shaped, T shaped block there as well. Possibly a toilet block next to that. So that's the bomb stores, the bomb dump to the right in the trees. And now fly into the uh, 269 Squadron section of uh, the Cold War days. With the Thor missiles, three Thor, Thor missiles were based on this base, the PGM. They were all controlled by RAF Hemswell. I do believe the warheads came from Hemswell, under armed guard by road, some construction. If you pop it on pause, there's a little bit about uh, the Thor strategic missile. Uh, this was called Project Emily. Came from America, American missiles. Intermediate range ballistic missiles. Yeah. Right, so we'll take a little short flight over the pads and see what's left. There's three, one middle left now. And then, as you can see in front, there's two in front. Those buildings that are on those pads are not original. All that's left is the chambers where the tanks used to be and the blast walls and the foot plates and some fire pits now just coming into view one at the top right and top left our water pits Okay, right now we are heading to the main gate. Some of those buildings on the road in were original, or still are the original buildings. Um, I'm not entirely sure, 100%. I think the two to the left of the main buildings aren't original, but the white ones are original buildings. Uh, just to the bottom right is the fire station. Uh, so I'd imagine there was a control tower quite close. Um, I do have some plans, but they're a little blurred. Anyway, that's it, folks. Hope you enjoyed that. 
and uh, take it easy and we'll see you all again on our next video. Thank you.